hi all uh, today we are going to see why uh, angular what made angular to come out of the blue so why suddenly this phrase angular application everywhere so uh, in uh, future we would have worked with uh, jquery dojo javascript and many other so what we frequently used to do in javascript we used to do it document dot get element id we used to get element and change the dom using this we actually change the dom of input id we uh, change the value in that and uh, next jquery came what it did did, did is it uh, made this dom manipulation little bit easier with the help of dollar we were able no need uh, for us to repeat document dot get element id everywhere and we were uh, able to easily do it with dollar and uh, next, uh, uh, and there were some other frameworks like uh, ehtjs and uh, dojo. And uh, suddenly uh, Angular came and uh, it became so famous, so popular. So what is the basic reason for it? What, uh, what it did to make developer life easier? Or So let us see that. So basically what Angular did is, it reduced, it made uh, the developer life so much easier. So uh, it came into market and told that the why the developer need to do DOM manipulation, what we used to do, right? So it uh, said that developer no need to do DOM manipulation. It is all low level. So you don't do the DOM manipulation. You just do the business logic. And the DOM manipulation, it is not that uh, in uh, in case of angle, DOM manipulation is not happening. This DOM manipulation is something, uh, it is changing the elements in the DOM. Maybe the button is changing to blue based on the press. You are uh, updating the value in the form from the value from the server. It is, uh, this DOM manipulation is happening, but it is internally taken care by Angular. The developer need not write any code to do that. Okay, by means of this, what happened is the developer did only the business logic. Okay, uh, business logic in the sense what is needed for the application. That alone it did. Maybe I will change my name to Karthik. If I mention it uh, in the model, this uh, it will update this value somewhere in the DOM. But the developer didn't write anything, any code for that. So this drastically reduced the developer time, development time. So that's the reason why Angular people started uh, adopting Angular everywhere. So that the development cost is reduced a lot. Okay. So let us now see what is Angular. Okay. So basically, uh, this Angular language is written in TypeScript. What is TypeScript? TypeScript is a <coughs> superset of JavaScript, which was developed uh, developed by Microsoft, so that uh, it gives typing to JavaScript. Okay, it uh, gives intelligence that uh, IDE support to JavaScript, so that the developer knows while he uh, codes itself that he is doing some mistakes so it uh, helped the developer to uh, get to know of the mistakes before compiling or interpreting it, he is able to get to know the issues beforehand okay so it is written in typescript and uh, what is angular it is used for building client side application in HTML and JavaScript or uh, language like TypeScript only rule that is that the all the whatever you can write uh, uh, the Angular application in JavaScript TypeScript JavaScript or CoffeeScript whatever the rule is that it should compile to JavaScript okay that is the rule and um, other next important point is it is used for developing single page application what is single page application uh, if you see in uh, past, people have multiple pages, home.html, login.html and uh, for uh, maybe if it lets any element, 
it will say add page dot html delay delete page dot html so for each functionality they had pages but with the venture of uh, angular this we don't have uh, multiple pages we have only a single page if you open an uh, angular application you will see only a single page index.html and uh, in the same page they, uh, different components are getting inserted into the same page but we don't have a uh, multiple pages okay that's the crux of it so this is for developing a single page application we have to reiterate it we have only single page based on the clicks or uh, based on uh, the server uh, what we get from the server so wh whatever be the uh, functionality involved the different components are getting inserted into the same page and other important point is web page okay what is a web page in angular if you see a web page in angular it is a mix up of different components okay we have many components put together we have one page so what uh, improvement we get out of using components because it is reusable this header component we can use th the same header component somewhere in our different project it becomes yes uh, small bit which is which can be reused elsewhere okay so if you take a web page a simple web page it it is like uh, missing some four components a header component a footer component sidebar and section component this put together we get a web page in angular so so only i have mentioned that it is a build up of components put together okay uh, which puts together different components different components are put together by module we have something called module in angular which puts together through ng module we are able to mix up the components which is building and uh, angular if you see it is a component based mvc design what is component based mvc design we say it is a component based mvc because inside a component itself we are able to see that mvc design okay uh, the view the the html of the component is the view okay the model model which the view represents is called a model and the component class which controls the model is the c controller so that controls the model which is displayed in the view okay so inside a component itself we are able to see the mvc design so we say it as a component based mvc design so other thing uh, common thing people have a uh, doubt is whether angular is a framework or library okay if you take angular it is a library it is a framework it is not a library it is a framework we call it it as a framework because it has all the necessary entities for building the application you need not go to any third party for getting something okay it has the complete package it comes as a complete package for building a web application so it is a structural framework for building dynamic web apps i made a small issue here so hope you understood uh, why we uh, the why angular why what made angular popular so much so let me let us see the angular architecture in the next session thank you